about it. Oh, I don't want to be on it. Okay. Well, here's the deal. So I've seen that the Holy Biscuit, Elvis Biscuit, right? Everybody wants the fat Elvis. But I'm talking to the person who makes the biscuits, and he says the Holy Biscuit is the way to go. It's smoked shredded biscuit, roasted street corn queso, thick cut bacon, Texas honey with a kick, pickled French fries, and savory sweet secret sauce. I can see why. Good stuff. I want to see one live. Any of them. A biscuit. It's on right on the other side. Oh, there we go. That's a holy biscuit. That's a holy biscuit. Wow. That's the one, you guys. Thank you. Favorite as well? Um, this is my favorite. Okay. This is the apple pie egg roll. 
No yes. kidding. Bacon apple pie egg roll. Yes, yes. And next to it, we have our sweet bacon bacon. Bacon, um, actually it's a sponge cake wrapped in bacon, dipped in funnel cake with powdered sugar. You can't go wrong with that. Oh, you heard it from the lady yeah. who works here. And so, so when you go to eat, you always ask the people, hey, what are you doing in the back, right? So you heard it right here. No reason to try any other menu items. We got one more. Oh, we got one more. And this one looks like there could be Cheetos on it. What's going on here? This is our cool chick nachos. We also have it in hot chick as well. It's your basic uh, nachos with lettuce and tomato and bacon and uh, chicken. And you can get uh, plain Cheetos or hot Cheetos and drizzled in. Uh, you can have sriracha or ranch. Ooh. And it's the bomb. Sriracha. It's amazing. The bomb, no cap. Yeah. With yeah, the sriracha, amazing. I bet it is. Well, you heard it right here, everybody. Listen, bacon, bacon, bacon. Nation, come find it this yeah this week now until the end of um, October and uh, Mayor Applewood is here and we're, we're, we're making sure that our, our Applewood bacon's awesome so thank, thank you. you. Thank this you. is where you go. Hashtag uh, YouTube Famous yes. in Texas. Well that was fun. We had our own little lady giving us a tour. Maybe we need to do that with all of the all of the stores. So I had the brisket tacos and they were okay. I mean, you know, I think I chose it mainly because when I'm at the state fair, I really want to get into all these sloppy nacho bacon, you know, eatable with a fork and your fingers. But I'm also at the state fair. There's got to be like 8,000 people that are here. And, you know, that's just a lot of germs. And anyways, we don't have to say that. But I will tell you this. The way to go at the state fair is to bring a backpack. And also, I am a huge fan of these, these bar mops. So when I cook at home and I barbecue at home, and I eat at home, I use these bar mops instead of paper towels. A, because it ends up being a lot more fun with cooking because you can just throw the towel over your shoulder. And then B, you know, I mean, you're cooking and you're prepping and, and sometimes barbecue can have sticky fingers and you just really need a towel versus a paper towel. So what I did was I took one with me and I also took a handful of you know, wipes in a Ziploc bag so that when I was done eating or touching maybe a ride or a table, I could wipe my hands and feel clean and sanitary and not have like sticky fingers everywhere. And that's what I did. So I would highly recommend bringing a bar mop, throw it in your backpack. It's been a really good save for me and I'm super glad that I did it. So my thoughts for the Texas State Fair 2022.